Now, 27 storm track weather with meteorologist Alexis Clemens. Well, good Sunday morning. We're taking a look outside our WKW tower cam, looking at the sun, a beautiful sunrise this morning. Take those pictures if you can and send them, send them our way. However, the reason why it is so vibrant, those vibrant colors is because we do have a little bit of smoke in the air, moderate air quality, still okay to be outside, but we are going to kind of see that smoke hang around for the next few hours. Nice morning though, cooler 60 in Madison, 59 in Middleton, 62 in Baraboo, 66 in James. Gainesville. We're sitting at 65 over in Prairie du Chien. As we go through our day, I think temperatures are only topping out in the upper 70s this afternoon. Starting out with more of that hazy sunshine, we're going to end with more cloud cover. That's what's going to keep us a little bit cooler through our day today, but you'll notice also rain chances are going to start to increase in the afternoon hours, but not everyone will see them. If you were with us yesterday, we were tracking this system. It was gaining that energy, gaining that moisture over the Dakotas. Now it's making its way into Iowa and Minnesota. Unfortunately, though, it does not doesn't have as much energy and moisture as we originally thought. And instead of making an easterly track towards us, it is going to dip now to the southeast. Now that is good news because it keeps the severe threat out of our area. However, it's also going to take a lot of the rain as well. So I think if we do see any of those showers today, I don't even expect any thunder with it. It should just be rain showers and it's going to stay mostly towards the state line and the Mississippi River, so south and west. And I'll have a better pre presentation of that representation coming up in just a bit, but this is going to stay two hours south, but those rain chances will stick around in those areas through this afternoon, through tonight, and then into tomorrow morning. Then we see the sunshine return, and I expect us to stay dry through Tuesday as we'll be sunny and seasonal then. So rainfall totals have dropped. Those are higher amounts going to stay to our south, but I do think a half an inch or less very possible in those areas that I was talking about. And here's kind of a highlight of what we're looking at here. So along the Mississippi River, as the system comes in, it's going to dip just south of us and then make its way back up in the uh, in Lake Michigan. So a 30 to 40 percent chance for those areas there. Now there are more rain chances on the way. We're watching Wednesday and Friday right now, so we'll keep you updated as it gets closer. Temperature is going to be in the upper 70s and low 80s through this week. Thursday and Saturday look to stay dry as well as Tuesday.